hey guys welcome to my channel so i already color corrected i'm gonna start off with my foundation which is milani 2-in-1 and a black radiance foundation and i'm just going to mix those together and i'm going to put them on my face but first let's not forget to prime our face with a setting spray and i am using the wet and wild setting spray now we're just gonna put the foundation on our face all over and I kind of like this mix but I'm probably gonna change my foundation soon so now I'm going to be using two LA girl pro concealers in the color fawn and dark cocoa and make those together for my highlight under my eyes just gonna spread that out I want to put it under my eye, my chin, top of my forehead. You know, we're gonna cut that nose real quick. And I'm just gonna use my beauty blender. Also need a new one, but we just gonna work with it and we're just gonna blend till we can't blend no more. And I'm trying to lightly just spread it out so it's not patchy. And that's so I can also get the most coverage out of it as well. So now I'm going to be using my Nika K Duo Contour Kit. And it has two really dark colors that I really like using for contouring. And I basically use that on my cheeks. I mean, side of my face. And top of my forehead. You know cut that jawline I'm just gonna blend that out with a more fluffier brush just to make sure it's not too harsh and now I'm basically using the same powders to also cut that nose I really don't need to be doing this you can actually skip this step if you want to but I'm just extra why not and I'm just gonna blend that with an elf brush And now I am going to use my Airspun and Sasha Buttercup powder and I mix them together and I'm just going to lightly set my under eye and my eyelids and basically everywhere that I highlighted and I am not baking because I do not want to be patchy so I've been liking this whole you know pressing the powder into your skin method. And now I'm going to be using my MAC blush and raisin. This is my all time favorite blush. And sometimes I actually mix it with orange eyeshadow to give me more of a like a really warm look. But this is my all time favorite brush by MAC. Don't sleep on MAC. MAC is still the ish. Get you some. And now I'm going to be using my Black Radiance Eyeliner. This eyeliner is actually pretty, pretty good. So don't sleep on them either. But I'm just going to be outlining, you know, my bottom eye. And also I'm going to be doing the top as well, you know, just to make sure it looks more defined. And then I'm going to be my, I'm going to use my ColourPop Wisp highlighter and now I'm just using a basic dark brown lip pencil from the beauty supply store nothing fancy to be honest just as long as it's like the darkest brown you're good I'm just using that to outline my lips and now I'm going to be using my Milani lip gloss and I don't remember the name but I will put the information down below but I'm um, using that as my lip gloss and i use that every single day it's my favorite lip gloss ever it's not too sticky not too shiny it's perfect now for the eyeshadow i am using my morphe 350 palette if you don't have it once again get your life this is my everyday palette 
I literally use this palette every day and it's amazing. It has literally all the warm shadows that I love. I'm trying to get more into color, but this palette is the ish. Now I'm going to be using basically two reddish brownish color and I'm just going to be using that on my crease and I'm just going to blend that out this is really quick this is my on the go look you guys like I do this every morning especially for school days this is my on the go look when I still want to look snatched but you know natural snatched this is my look so I'm just gonna you know blend that into my crease and after that I'm going to take a warm neutral you know eyeshadow and i'm just gonna put that on my lid and that is basically it for the eyeshadow look three colors you need three or four actually and you're pretty good now i'm going to be using this eyeliner don't remember the name but i will put it down below in the information box description box but this is actually one of my favorite eyeliner at the moment and i usually use um cream which i still love but i love how the pencil on this is it's very precise so i'm just going to do a quick liner to really define my eye but once again you don't have to do this step you could honestly just do eyeliner i mean um mascara after this and you'll be fine but i like a little you know eyeliner just a little quick lean you know nothing too fancy Now I'm just going to prep my eyelashes for my lashes <laughs> that I'm going to also put on top of my own lashes. Today I kind of felt, you know, sometimes I wear lashes even on a, you know, natural makeup day and sometimes I don't. It all depends on how I'm feeling that day but this day I felt like being a little bit more, you know, out there, you know, so added some lashes and these lashes i actually don't know the name i got them from a shoe and i don't remember the name but you could basically use demi wispies but that is all you guys comment like subscribe love y'all